So hello guys welcome back to the channel and this video will cover another amazing lab that is working with artifact registry so first of all click on start lab and open the cloud console incognito window now just activate your cloud shell meanwhile if you haven't subscribed the channel yet do subscribe it and like the video now click on continue and just click on authorize button like this now first thing is that in the description box of this video i've shared one github repository you can check it out first of all we have to export the zone so let me show you you can use a personal notepad or any uh, notebook also just copy it paste over here and just select the zone from the cluster here like here is the reason here is the zone so just careful select it and paste over here remove the extra content and extra space it should be like this now copy it and paste over here now you can close the notepad also and now one thing you need to do you have to just copy this and paste on the cloud shell now it will take some time so just wait for it So now by default the cloud shell editor will open here and don't worry i will tell you step by step method how we will complete this lab because some of you are facing issues but actually there were no issues you need to just follow the way i am doing so here what you need to do wait for the cloud shell editor to load it's slow really very slow so you just need to be waiting till you get the files so here what you need to do yes once the file is loaded click on here and from here click on the compute engine and select the project so just select it sometimes it refreshes itself so just wait for it now again you have to just click on the cloud code and from here click on the compute engine now click on login then select a project so here basically we have to select our project id from the lab instructions so just select this one and once it's done what we need to do we have to copy one image id first of all we will move to this directory and type yes first of all copy this image id you can see just above the seven number now click on view command palette and just type run on kubernetes this one okay i am repeating this step again command palette run on kubernetes and just this one now it will take some time so wait for it now here you have to select which file you have to select hello world one you can confirm from the lab instructions too we have to select this file hello world so just select it and it will build will be docker file now the build is starting now you have to just click on yes now here we have to choose the image repository i hope you have copied the image id from the task just above the task number seven you have to just enter it and press enter you can see you have to press enter now it will take some time and once the deploy is completed then we'll be able to check the score so just wait for a few more seconds now you can see the status has succeeded now what you have to do just go back to the lab instruction and check the score for the task so you will get the score for all the tasks except the last one we have to do it manually only so now you can open the terminal and go to the lab instruction and paste now in case you haven't subscribed the channel do subscribe it and like the video we are done with the lab guys have a great day